Hey guys, it's Lego Wars 82500 here, and now I'm gonna make a review on Lego Ninjago Skull Motorbike. And yeah, so here's the box. Right. I'll view this out first. Oh, let's move. There, Lego Ninjago over there, that's Kai. Masters of Spin Jitsu. Uh, is this J? I think J. Is it J? Uh, yeah. So this is J, and I forgot this guy. And here they're fighting, and you got the list of weapons gold weapons that you can get in each set I already have the scythe and the uh, nunchucks so I'll just put this back here so here's the manual so it's thick, it's a thick manual so let's go on with the minifigures here you got J is a very nice minifigure with these gold nunchucks. See. It's called nunchucks, which is just a chain attached to some lightsaber pieces that are different. And here's Jay. Uh, he got that symbol right over there. It's like a storm or water or cloud symbol, lightning, whatever. He's a blue ninja, all blue. He's got the, the belt design there. Uh, his black katana, it's completely black. I could, have used, I could use this as Ichigo's new model of the Senpakuto. And you got his face and his mask. The face is quite plain, but he looks Asian. Yeah, he looks Asian indeed. It's color yellow, of course. It's Asian. Like me. And uh, you can just slide that sort that down there wait just a sec and you can hold this nunchucks like this and then spin around like that so that's Jay here is skeleton warrior which I forgot his name sorry about that so it's a very nice minifigure this boots oversized boots his back is showing while the front is not, so that's a pre pretty much disadvantage about your armor. It's not covering the back. So on to the minifigure. He has this bone axe with the bronze, the bronze um, axe head or something. Gray armor with a skull symbol there. Then. Uh, he's got that skull, skull head. It's, it's like he's grinning, smiling, and it's like he's got the. He's like he's wearing a, he's wearing a Nazi style helm, which is this one. But it doesn't extend, right, really at the back, at the like lower back right here, because Nazi style helms extend that to the backs of their heads. So. It's close enough to the to the Nazi style helm, which I could make a custom minifigure. I'm just gonna put his sword back on his hand. Right. Now on to the vehicle, which is the skull motorbike. It's a very nice <clears throat> bike, which is very big. You got that small wheel right over there, and this big wheel right at the back. 
it's big wheel then there are these two elephant tap tusks that are sticking right over there sticking out right over there then there are those this is there's a like a skull a skull face there with fangs and horns right over here and the cool thing about this is that the the fire the fire that is sticking out from the pipes right over here i forgot what 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 that was called but yeah <clears throat> you got a sticker there but of a skull and another sticker right over there and that kind of bulk thing so here's the main play, play feature of the set you can flip you can flip this this switch then do that and this happens let me show you again see so that's very cool and bonus eye or whatever I forgot his name but I know there's a skeleton called bonus eye so he st stands there and over there there like that he's gonna kill people then he can kill Jay like this other than running him over like that he can also kill him like this oops I think this must be right over here there he will kill him like this he died so that's my review of the skull motorbike i hope you enjoyed it please rate comment subscribe and i'll see you later bye